Dear, why are you up so early? It's the March holidays, no need to drop Brayden off at school. I'm going to work. So early? Mm hmm I thought, you know, we could spend some time together. You're ovulating again. Yes, but that's not the point. Shall we go for dinner tonight? Just the two of us. We haven't... I can't. I have a lot of backlogs at Swat Hao. Bye. Why is it? Make it quick. A lot of viewings today. Yeah, and it's the March holidays. I have to take care of the kid and the client all at the same time. What's so urgent? You were right about Ace. He used me to close his own deals and made me miss so many classes that I didn't hit the minimum attendance for the housing agent course. So you can't register for the exam now? I have to start all over again. Sign up for another RES course. Are you sure that's another 800 over dollars for the course fees? I want to be a housing agent. If this is the only way I can get there, then there's no other choice. Okay, lah. Do what you want. Why tell me? I want you to be my mentor. After what your mentor did to you, you want another Even one. Even though Ace sabot me by making me follow him to his viewings, I still learned a lot from him. Okay. Then why should I mentor you? And worse, what if I spend time to mentor you and you decide you don't want to be a housing agent anymore? I won't. I'm serious about this. Like you were serious about direct sales and badminton? This is different. Give me a chance to prove it. I'll do anything. Anything! Ready with your questions? You must answer each real estate question within one minute. If you don't know the answer, you fail. If you get it wrong, you fail. If you make them wait too long, you also fail. Wow, so scary, yeah. If you want me to mentor you, prove that you're worthy. And your time starts now. Uh, my nephew is getting married and wants to buy a house. Which is better, BTO or resale? Um, that depends. If uh, he's in a hurry, if he's picky about location and wants a bigger place, then resale. But if he's on a budget and wants better capital appreciation, then BTO. Ayo, that boy is not on budget. Wait, what's their total combined income every month? Uh, about 15k. Then they're not eligible for BTOs anyway. The income ceiling for BTOs is 14k. They can try ECs instead. Correct. Next. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, I've always wanted to live in a maisonette, but it's so difficult to find one. Not true. There are maisonettes in Amukyo, Bishan, Bedok. Oh, so far away. Is there anything like nearby here? Um, uh, Queenstown. Queenstown. Yeah, near the market. Food there is very nice. Uh, if we move there. <coughs> What will we? Huh? I'll stay there by myself. It'll be so quiet and peaceful without you. You don't want to stay with me, huh? Okay, you go and get your stupid mansion. I'll go and look for something bigger like uh, jumbo flat. Jumbo flat. You dumb dumb. Huh? Jumbo flat only got one floor. Mansion got two floors. Actually, the biggest jumbo flat can be over 2,000 square feet. But the biggest mezzanine is only 1,700 square feet. Ah, I win. <laughs> and they don't come cheap. They normally cost around 600k. Wow. Wow, Juliana, I think we are happy in sunny place, huh? Stop! This is Olivia's job. Why are you doing it? By the time she gets here, there'll be customers and we won't have time. Hey. Supposed to start work at 9. Now it's 9.05. Late for work again. Late for work and avoiding my course. After I spoke to her, this woman is too much. I'm going to scold her. Ma, it's just so much easier to do it myself. Don't you dare. This is her job. Put down the broom. Now, now, now. Now, now. Sandra? Hey, Rani. You're here to see the cheeky girl. Eh? <sighs> and to see you. Yeah. I want the two of you. Okay. She just had a milk and uh, she has been burped, so now sleeping. Hmm. 
How about you? Must be tired. Yeah, nothing I can't handle. Raising a child isn't easy. That's why Child Protective Service has so many officers to help parents to juggle between children and daily life. I'm okay. I don't have a job and I've cut down on my grassroots activities so that I can help Khadija. What about money? Diapers, formula, all of that is expensive. Oh, you are right, huh? $20 for a small tin of baby formula and that was the cheapest. Wow, it's a good thing we all are helping each other with the cost. I wonder how long more we can do this for. I'm sure we can figure out something. Oh. Eh, okay. I won't keep you. Just look after yourself. I know you're doing this to help Katija. But I don't think she would want you to push yourself too hard. I am all right. Don't worry, I'm fine. Okay, bye. Again, you're doing her work. Where's Olivia? Ma, please. You take Tolan. Sister. Ma, she's not slacking off. Olivia has been helping me with this and she's got an allergic reaction because of the dust. I told her to go and see her doctor. Wait, 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 wait. Quack, quack, quack. Ducks in the farm go. Quack, quack, quack. Thanks for meeting me, man. After you ran out on uh, Juliana, I almost didn't want to. Huh? But everybody deserves a second chance. Miss Ayang. Miss Papa? Hmm. What do you want? I thought about what you said that day. You are right. My children deserve better. Katija and Iskanda, too late. But I can still try to be a good father to Juliana. Mamad, it is not me you need to convince. I know. I'll do anything. But for now, I just want to spend some time with my baby girl. Just for a few hours. I miss her. <laughs> okay. Jilly, come. Don't want the nice auntie to see your handsome papa looking old. Much better. <laughs> hey, Wing Fai. Hmm? Okay. Hey, the two of you are drinking bubble tea. Isn't that for kids? I thought so also. Uh, until Chan got me to try this. This brand is different. Ah, their caramel flavor, wow, super nice, eh? Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh you try the Earl Grey tea. Mm. Very fragrant. Hey, we are Chinese. We drink Chinese tea. Why do you need to drink this funny amorte? Hey, this is not amorte, you see? <clears throat> eh, they got Chinese name also. Oh, wow, they're TCM some more. See? <laughs> Li Yue? Yeah. How do you all get this? I, uh, my boss made a deal with this Li Yue TCM. We are helping to sell their bubble tea. Here? Hey, Toki Heng, I tell you, uh, once I tasted it, uh, I couldn't stop drinking it. How come your TCM never sell bubble tea? Uh? We do! Yeah, but the hot bubble tea with no sugar, no milk. No taste. You! No taste! My bubble tea is made with premium ingredients, okay? No taste. Yeah, but not nice. Who on the drink? Okay, hey, I tell you, you try this. Maybe it'll give you some idea to improve your bubble tea. Might as well drink poison. Hey, wait, you take poison for what? Throw away! Hey, hey, one bottle, two, two, two fifty, hey! That woman has gone too far. I know. That Olivia. Not Olivia. Li Yue. She's copying our bubble tea. And she's selling her cheap imitation right under our shop. She opened a shop downstairs? Worse. She made a deal with the Crown Coffee Shop to sell her tea. She's doing this to catch out me. Don't be so worked up. What are you doing? Taste testing our competitors' products. We need to fight back. When I come back, 
You better have a plan to chase that old lady and her bubble tea out. Ah! Indiana! Nah, hey. thanks. Hey, 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 hey. Why is there a bruise on the forehead? Did she hit on something or what? Uh, yeah, I think it was a bottle. Why did you stop her? If she wants to hit the head with a bottle, it's not my fault. Hey, what if she fractured the skull? Hey, hello. It's just a bruise. I'll call you when I want to see her again. Bye. Hey, Robert. Robert, hey, come back. So what do you guys want to have for lunch? Oh, give me a second. Hey, waiting for someone? No, just nothing. You have nothing to be ashamed of. I know. Do you want to join me and my friends? We wouldn't have anything to talk about. Of course you would. You're from the same course. Come on, let me introduce you. You need friends even as a journalist, you know. Sure. Come. Is Juliana okay? Um, yeah, she's okay. The doctor said it was just a bruise. Thank goodness. Yeah. Hey, Katisha, I didn't want to worry you, but uh, I brought her to the doctor, you know, in case it was anything more serious. You did the right thing, Uncle Chandra. Thank you so much. Uh, that guy, uh, uh, he didn't care his daughter is hurt, you know. He had the cheek to tell me that he'll call me again when he wants to see her. Huh? He think what? He can just, you know, swan in and out of Juliana's life when he feels like it, eh? Technically, he can, because he's still her father. For the last time, Ace, I did not tell Hafik that you sabotaged him. Then how do you find out about the minimum attendance requirement? How should I know? Anyway, it doesn't matter. He doesn't qualify for the exam. Just keep an eye on him. I don't think he'll give up so easily. Unless he has a time machine, there's nothing he can do about it. Hi. Hi. I'm so sorry I'm late. No problem. Duduk lah. Cik Ibrahim, how are you? Sayang, huh? Farah asked you a question. <sighs> Sorry. I was going through my physio stuff in my head. There's so much to remember. An exam is coming soon. How? Are you ready? I think so. How about your housing agent exam? Can pass or not? Actually, it looks like I won't be taking the exam anytime soon. Huh? What happened? You studied very hard for it. He said that he would help me register for the exam. But he lied. Why? He was so helpful when he sold our flat. And wasn't he teaching you about real estate? He was using me, Baba. I don't know what's wrong with me. It's like Albert all over again. Why do I keep getting conned by these liars? Fake, it's not your fault. But maybe this is a sign, you know? a sign that real estate isn't the best place for you? What are you going to do now? I'm not giving up, Mama. I'm going to sign up for the real estate course again. And this time, I'm not going to miss a single class. Yes! Peeling agreed to be my mentor. A new mentor? Fake. it's like you're starting from zero. Are you sure it's worth your time and money? Hey, what are you saying? Fig? If that's what you want to do, then go for it. We'll support you. Yeah, her name is Juliana binti Rahmat. Her father's name is Rahmat bin Azman. Yeah, I don't think she is safe in his care. I mean, he's not abusive, but he neglected her and abandoned her. Yes. So when he came back to see her, she got injured when she was with him. Yes. You can reach me at the number I gave you. Yeah? Okay. Thank you so much. Bye bye. So, how? Huh? They'll start an investigation. But in the meantime, she will be under temporary care. Oh, it's a good thing that you called them. I mean, it's the right thing to do. Hey, I'll be back. I'm so sorry, Juliana.
CPS took her away. Mm -hmm. At least now she'll be safe. This wasn't your fault. I could have reported him earlier, G. You didn't want to separate Juliana from her ayah. This wasn't an easy decision for you. But hopefully, now he'll get a wake-up call and learn to take responsibility. For Juliana's sake. How can you do this to us? Do what? You're still going to continue with that silly real estate thing? It's important to me. And what about me? What about our wedding? I had to do everything alone. The hotel, the wedding planner, Everybody asks me where's the groom and I have nothing to say. Look, I know it's been hard on you, but I'm trying to start a new career. Why do you need a new career when you can just go back to playing badminton? Stop wasting time with this nonsense. I am not wasting my time. This is something that I want to do for myself. Why can't you just support me? Because you are a star. And now you're giving that up to become some nobody. Have you even been listening at all? I am done with badminton, Farah. You need to accept that. No, fake. As your fiancé, I'm not letting you make the biggest mistake of your life. Everybody wants to see you make a comeback to sports. When I told the reporters that you were returning to badminton, you should have seen their faces. So you were the one who started that rumour? You went behind my back and lied to those reporters? I did it for your own good, Fig. I know you better than you know yourself. Six months down the road, when you're winning matches and back in the spotlight where you belong, you'll thank me for this. She's my daughter. None of my business. You neglected her and then you abandoned her. If you're not happy, then tell me. Huh? Why call CPS? Now I have to go for counselling, you know. They are trying to help you be a better father. They are wasting my time. You know? I'm glad I called them because now you will have to face the consequences of what you did to Juliana in court. Hey, hey, hey. This affects Julie too. Uh, you hate her growing up in her children's home. Now you're putting Juliana through the same thing. Once the investigation is over, I will take care of <laughs> You think they're going to let you? Huh? No husband, no money. You will never see her again. Anthony, so how? How are we going to kick that old lady lousy bubble tea out of sunny place? I didn't have time to think of anything. No time to think. This is war. Our enemy is at our doorstep. Her bubble tea is at Crown Coffee Shop. Next, Belmora Hardware. And then where? Swat out TCM. Okay, okay. You think about it tonight and tell me tomorrow. Uh, pa, instead of trying to kill Li Yue, why don't we think of something to improve our tea? What is wrong with our bubble tea? People don't like it. People are wrong. And now that that woman is selling her bubble tea all over the place, no one will get the chance to see that my tea is better. Is it better? Of course. How can you even ask? <sighs> You'll never see her again. That's what he said. Ah, this man really makes me want to strangle him, I tell you. He's probably right. OK, but what if... What if I raised her? I mean, technically, I'm family. And the three of us have been doing a good job of taking care of her so far. It's not a long-term solution. Katija, you're still in school. And you're not financially stable. I'll be helping her out. We can follow the same system as before. She'll drop Juliana off before she goes to work and then picks up again at night. But that's not a stable environment for a child to grow up in. Besides, look at the two of you. You're exhausted. And Chandra, you can't keep shifting your other commitments around to take care of Juliana. You didn't tell me you were doing that. Uh, it's not important, huh? And what about the cost of raising a child? It's a big commitment. It's only going to get more expensive as Juliana grows up. Then I should just let her go into state care? How will I know if she's going to be okay? You have to trust the system. A child protection officer will investigate the situation. Based on the findings, the youth court will make sure that she's put in a stable and nurturing environment. You mean foster care? It's the best thing for Juliana right now. Hey, 
哎，宝贝，有得多重担啊？没有。Hey, you don't care about your health. This is high in sugar, high in calories, full of milk. You want doubt? Oh, you want diabetes? Then you can go ahead and drink it. Ah, drink it. Good, good choice. This is Li Yue TCM bubble tea, made with premium herbs for your well-being. The taste is A one, unrefined brown sugar, so it's better for you. Two fifty, please. Yeah, quick. Give him two fifty, so you can get diabetes. Wait, 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 wait. Why you chase away my customer? Still there to us. I thought we were friends. How can you betray me like that? Where go? This. How can you promote that old lady's bubble tea here instead of mine? It's my job. I get fifty cent commission every bottle I sell. Oh, so that's all our friendship is worth. Fifty cents. Then I don't friend you. Hey, business is business, friend is friend, ma. Juliana won't stay with us anymore. At least it'll be quieter at night now, can? No more crying. Yeah, but too quiet also no good. I'll miss her. Just because she's not staying with us doesn't mean she's out of our lives, Adi. Yes, she'll have a new family, ka. Yes, but she's still our sister, and we need to look out for her. I'm not going to give up and leave her in the care system. Not like what Aya did to us. It wasn't so bad. I like being over the rainbow. No, Juliana is not going to grow up in a children's home or in foster care. We are family. She belongs with us, and I'm going to make sure she stays with us. Oh, they are over time. This is highly unprofessional of you. So sorry. Next time, be more mindful of your timekeeping, okay? Both you, they get the message, huh? You two can go. Hey, Harish! I was handling it. You were talking down to them. Nobody likes that. Their tardiness happens to be very disrespectful to the staff who show up on time and ready for work. All I'm saying is, hmm, make your point and then move on. Huh? Adios. Adios. <laughs> <laughs>